Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got these uh, three squares of uh, various uh, dimensions put together as you can see in this uh, diagram. And moreover, this uh, green shaded uh, shape uh, has been wedged between uh, these uh, squares. And furthermore, uh, this uh, height of this uh, square is uh, three units whereas the height uh, of uh, this uh, square is uh, 5 units and this uh, height uh, difference uh, is uh, 4 units and now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green uh, shaded region please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe and please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% uh, true to the scale let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step. We know that this uh, height of this uh, smallest square is uh, 3. In other words, uh, this uh, height is going to be 3. And we know that uh, this uh, height uh, is uh, 4. So therefore, the height uh, of this uh, biggest uh, square is going to be 4 plus 3 is going to give us 7 units. So thus the height uh, of this uh, smallest square is uh, 3. The height of this uh, larger square is uh, 7 and finally the height of this uh, right hand square is uh, 5 units. And now since we are dealing with these all uh, squares that means all their side lengths uh, are uh, same. So therefore uh, the base uh, of this uh, smallest uh, square is going to be 3 units. The base uh, of uh, this uh, largest uh, square is going to be 7 units and finally the base uh, of this uh, right hand square is going to be 5 units and here's our next step since we are interested in calculating the area of this uh, green shaded uh, region so therefore in order to make our job uh, simple we are going to draw some uh, auxiliary lines as you can see in this uh, next step I have added uh, this uh, blue rectangle in order to make sure we get uh, this uh, right uh, triangle. Let me go ahead and label uh, these uh, triangles. I'm going to label uh, this uh, point A, this point uh, B and this uh, point uh, C. And as a result we are going to get uh, this uh, triangle uh, ABC. And likewise I'm going to label uh, this point as uh, D, E and uh, F as you can see over here and as a result we get uh, this uh, another right triangle uh, D E F uh, as well and please keep in mind that uh, these angles this angle and this angle uh, they are uh, 90 degrees each this is 90 degrees and this is uh, 90 degrees as well and now let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, A B C and we are going to calculate the area of this uh, triangle and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times base uh, times height and in our case uh, the base uh, of this triangle ABC is going to be 3 plus 7 is going to give us uh, 10 and the height uh, of this triangle ABC is going to be 3 so therefore the area of this triangle ABC is going to be a half uh, times uh, 10 uh, times uh, 3 and if we simplify this thing that is going to give us uh, 15 uh, square units and now let's focus on this uh, other right triangle uh, DEF and we are going to calculate the area of this triangle uh, DEF and we are going to use the very same area of a triangle formula area equals to a half times base uh, times height and here we can see that uh, this uh, length uh, is 7 plus 5 is going to give us uh, 12 and since uh, this uh, length uh, is same as uh, this uh, EF length uh, if this is 12 then this uh, EF length is going to be 12 as well and moreover this side length uh, of this uh, triangle uh, DE is same as uh, this uh, length uh, which is uh, 7 so therefore uh, DE length is going to be 7 units so therefore the area of this triangle uh, DEF is going to be a half uh, times uh, 12 uh, times uh, 7 
and if we simplify the right hand side that is going to give us uh, 42 square units and here's our next step let's focus on this uh, smallest uh, square i'm going to label this one uh, as our box uh, number one and uh, now we are going to focus on this uh, largest uh, square i'm going to label this one uh, as our box uh, number two and finally this is going to be our uh, rectangle and now let's make an observation and look at uh, this equation we can see that the total uh, area of this whole uh, shape uh, is uh, equal to the area of this uh, box uh, one plus the area of the box uh, two plus the area of the rectangle we are talking about uh, this uh, rectangle so therefore now our task is to calculate the area of this box uh, one the area of this box uh, two and moreover the area of the rectangle uh, as well and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, smallest uh, box number one and now let's recall the area of a square formula area equal to s square where s uh, is the side length of the square and we know the side length uh, of this uh, smallest uh, square is uh, three so therefore the area of this box uh, one is going to be three square that is going to be equal to nine and here's our next step we are going to calculate the area of this uh, box uh, two and we know its uh, dimension is uh, seven uh, units so therefore the area of this uh, box two is going to be seven uh, square that is going to give us uh, 49 and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, rectangle and now let's recall the area of a rectangle formula area equals to length uh, times width and here we can see the dimensions of this uh, rectangle are uh, five uh, and uh, seven so therefore the area of this uh, rectangle is going to be seven uh, times uh, five that is going to give us uh, 35 and here's our next step now we are going to calculate this uh, total area we already figured out uh, our box one area which is uh, nine the area of box two which is uh, 49 and the rectangle area as uh, 35 so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks so we are going to have a 9 plus 49 plus uh, 35 and if we add uh, all these value that is going to give us uh, 93 so therefore the total area turns out to be 93 square units and here's our final step and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, green uh, shaded uh, region and now let's make an observation we can see that this uh, green shaded area is going to be equal to the total area minus area of this triangle abc and uh, moreover minus uh, the area of this triangle def and we already figured out our total area as uh, 93 so therefore we are going to replace 93 over here likewise the area of this uh, triangle abc which is 15 i'm going to replace it over here and finally the area of this triangle def which is 42 i'm going to substitute uh, over here as well so therefore let's go ahead and fill in the blanks so 93 minus uh, 15 minus uh, 42 and if we simplify that is uh, is going to give us uh, 36 uh, square units so thus the area of this uh, green shaded region turns out to be 36 uh, square units and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye